So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get unlimited icon SPCs. As you can see there, if you want to pause at any point in the video to how many icons I have so far, I've done this F SPC probably about 50 times nearly now. And we have got, I wouldn't say almost all icons, we've got quite a lot, some of our SPCs on their own, as you know. But just to showcase that, first step, what you want to go do is, have all of these SBCs in your favorite. Now, if you don't have golds at all, do the daily gold and let me show you why. So we need 11 bronzes, which I'm gonna submit, and 11 silvers as well, as we submit the silver squad. And that's gonna give us 11 golds. So you can do this four times. If you don't have bronze and silvers, you're gonna to have to do bronze pack method into upgrades and then make your way through. But then you're gonna go over to the store. And of course, you're gonna open the bronze and silver packs, and then you're gonna go ahead and find the 11 gold players pack. Now, once you've got this, you get one rare and commons. Doesn't matter what you get out of these packs, you're going to get yourself a lot of player picks from doing this. Now, before I break that down, let's have a word from today's sponsor. If you want some FC coins, it's the best place to go. Time to upgrade your team. Head over to lootbar.gg. Best and most reliable place to buy coins. Don't forget to use code NANIC for 8% off on all your orders. Once they have made their way through, the coins will be delivered within the next 24 hours and you will be ready to improve any of your team. Like I said, the link will be down in the description and the comment section. Use code NANIC for 8% off and improve your team today. Now, with this pack in particular, we are going to break this down into every single card is going to go into a player pick. Now, this is only to do the Icon SBC, not to do anything else. So don't get confused when you're like, well, how do I get high rate of fodder for other SBCs? This isn't for that. Now, we are going to make our way over to the 80 plus SBC. So the 80 plus SBC is here, but I've just remembered we can actually go ahead and do the player pick. So when we go to the first one here, we need one rare and 10 commons. If I set this to newest, you can see here every card that we just got out of those 11 players is going to be here. And if you didn't know, Libertadores count as the rare. So we've got ourselves our one rare and the commons. Now you can do that SBC I showed you at the start four times. So that's 44 players, four rare. So you should be able to do this SBC at least twice or one halfway there and then get golds other ways. So go ahead and do the 83 player pick. So the first one has been complete, and then all of these cards can go straight back into our club. And I'm going to go and complete the other two before I get back as well. So we have completed all three of the 80 plus player picks now, 83 plus. I wanted to say as well, we have a Discord in the description if you want to come and join. And we're going to show you what to do with these 83 pluses. So they're very easy to get, as we get ourselves two 84s and 83. So we just take one of the 84s that's not a duplicate. We are looking to try and get a higher rate of fodder. An 85 is a little bit better. And our last one, can our luck increase slightly? as we get ourselves another 84. So these weren't the best example, but then it shows you that it doesn't always have to have crazy good pack pulls to be able to do that. So for example, our 85 is gonna go into this exchange. And with this 85, this is gonna give us one pick back. And I know you're already thinking, oh, well, that's a silly way to do it. But trust me on this, the more you do this, the better chance you've got of completing extra SBCs. So that 85 is going to go into that. And I know you can go ahead and use that for the Icon SBC, but you want to go ahead and do this because there is a small chance, a chance, but a small chance of getting a walkout out of this or something else to go and help you on the way. Now with this um, Egon Core SBC that we're looking to do, we're only trying to get 85s, 84s and 83s. We're not looking to get anything else. So if we do get any high rated fodder, that's fantastic for later on. So with this, as you can see, they're all going to go into a player pick and we have ourselves our first 80 plus player pick. So all those cards have just come from that exchange. We've got one extra one, which is a rare, and we got ourselves an 80 plus player pick. Now, the more player picks you do, the more likely you are going to get high rated fodder. So right here, we got two 83s as a duplicate and an 80 that isn't going to help us. So we are going to go ahead and take this 83. Now, if you need team of the weeks for this, you're going to have to go ahead and do the team of the week player pick SBC. But right now, I don't need a team of the week. So I have this 83 times 10. We need to have an 83 rated team and a team of the week. I actually got a team of the week from a members video I did. If you want to join the membership or want to know what it is, it's basically a way to show you how to grind. On top of that, you'll get exclusive access to a Discord server on top of the one already in there that only members can see. It's got information in there and much more. And that's just going to help you basically learn how to grind, not spend money on the game. And you have 100% guarantee back on all of your questions as well. And that is in a Discord as well. Like some guy asked me a question the other day about how to do Jarzinho, and I went through and did an actual exclusive video on the members forum to break it all down. So if that's something you're interested in, that link will be down below. So as you can see here, we've got a team of the weekend and we've got an 83 rated squad. Now you could argue that we've gone a little bit over the rating with 83s. The reason why I do that is because we're going to get so many 83s times 10s back. Now a little bonus here, if you are doing the 83 plus player picks like I did at the start, 
What you'll notice is you'll get all of these bronze packs. Go ahead and put them into the daily login and the bronze upgrades. Get them all done and then you'll make yourself into a better opportunity. So starting off here, we're going to open up our 83 plus times 10. But first send our duplicate back into our club. Now we want a team of the week out of this if we can. If we don't, it doesn't matter. So it's going to be English. It's going to be right back. Probably Trent. Is it a double walkout? Now that is the question. It is a double walkout. It's going to be the long animation, so I'm just going to skip it to save everybody's time. And let's just see what we get out of this pack. So we get an 87 and an 84, 84, 84, 83, 83, 83, 83 and Botman again, 83. So no problem. And a Trent. So right away, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go and put Trent and Cobble into the exchange SPCs. So by doing that, we get 30 players back, and then that's going to give us X amount of extra 80 plus player picks from an 83 times 10. Now, if you probably noticed, I'm only putting in 85s and higher into these. I know you can go 90 rated, etc. But of course, we don't actually have any of those cards yet. If you get a 90 rated card, and if we did it in this video, I'll show you what to do. If not, don't worry too much. But you basically want to put 86s into 89s until you have yourself in a good position to put 85s you don't have to worry about. But I put my first 85 in was just to show you what to do in that example. Now, we are making our way over to our Trent as well. So now we've got ourselves 30 players, which is really nice to have. That's about 10 picks more or less, which is absolutely helpful in terms of getting more fodder back. So now if we make our way back over to the store, we've got our 83 Botman to deal with. And right now, I don't have any team of the weeks that I can put Botman into. Sorry, I don't have any team of the weeks to do an 83 times 10. So that means I'm going to have to do a team of the week player pick which is this one here if you don't know what it looks like. And as you can see here, we need an 84, an 83, or an 85, and an 83 rated team. So I'm going to go ahead and do this now. And that has been complete, and we've got quite a few 82s in there as well. So we've got a bit of our Botman. We've got a little bit of the team of the week on the way as well. And now we can go ahead and show you how the grind really works. So again, sending our Botman back into our club. I hope not to see him again in this video. And let's go over to our exchange packs. Now remember, we've got 30 players. So that's going to be 10 picks more or less. Let's open up our 19 first and see what we get out of this. So there's going to be a gold rare. It's going to be American. It's going to be a center back. So it doesn't look like anybody crazy. But again, not a problem. Because, for example, 85, fantastic for the icon SBC. All of these can be player picks. And then we've got six duplicates here. One rare and another rare. So I'm doing rares as one pick each. So that's going to be two picks back from this. And the reason why I'm switching these over one by one is because when I back out and go exit, so I'm slow later... We can go over back to the 80 plus player pick and they'll be ready to go on newest players. So let me go create those two 80 plus picks and I'll be back. So both those picks have been made and we're going to see what we get out of these. Now it is possible to get team of the weeks out of these and it is possible to get walkouts as you know and special cards as we get an 88 Edison. So going straight back to what we just did, we did one exchange from the 83 times 10. We got ourselves two player picks plus an extra two in a second and now we have an 88 rate card. It's going to be 27 players back, which again is going to be another 10 plus player picks or just under from doing this exchange. Now I know you're thinking to yourself, well you haven't done any of the Icon SBC yet, but I'm trying to show you how to do this if you're doing it from scratch. Once you get your head around this, you can then start doing the next step which i'll show you but i want to make sure that i'm very thorough with this to explain how this method works it's like trying to show you something brand new and take it step by step and then it gets into much quicker once you start doing other things so with our edison now we've got 27 players let's see what we get out of this so again another gold card spanish center mid it's going to be Parejo, which is another walkout and 86 rated. So that's more players to go in the exchange. We've got an 84 for the icon, an 83 for the icon. And again, loads more picks here. So you can see how many more picks we got. And we've got another 83 for the icon as well, or the team of the week if we need a team of the week. Now, again, I'm doing the same thing by swapping these one by one. You will do this much quicker once you've learned how to do it. But of course, I am trying to explain to you how you do this as we go through. So with our Gabby... I'm actually going to go ahead and do the rest of the team of the week player pick because I need to get the team of the week for the first step. So we need two 84s and a load of 81s and etc. But I will put Gabby into this. So if we go to our newest, there's our first 84. There's Gabby in. And then I can go back and switch this to high to low and then put the rest of the players that I need in. So as you can see, that has been done. We've got a load of 79s and low rated cards in. And now we have our first team of the week to go towards the Icon SPC because we need to have two of them. So it's not too bad here. Still got these three duplicates to deal with to go into picks as well. And bear in mind, I haven't made those picks. So we get ourselves an 85 here. Of course, we're going to take the highest rated to make it easier. And let me go ahead and make the picks out of those three players we got. And I'll be right back. 
So I made the first one, we got one dupe, but I've just decided out of all those packs I've just opened that you saw, I'm going to go ahead and make all the picks that we got from those packs. And I'll be back once all of those player picks have been made. So that last one has been made out of the bulk. Now, don't forget, we did make some player picks and we did some team of the week. So we got four here from doing those exchange packs. And we get an 87 in four minute, which we can go straight into the icon SBC. So we got the two team of the weeks now that we need. And now we're just looking for players that can help us out. Now, if you get in a situation like this with an 81, etc., just go ahead and put them into a player pick again. So any duplicates you get, like that bad squares, we're just going to put them back into the player pick. So we get an 83 as well. So we are well and truly on our way to doing this SPC. Now we have got ourselves a Vasquez, which what we're going to do here is we're actually going to go to favorites and we're going to go ahead and make one more player pick with Vasquez in it and just recycle him back around. Now, I wouldn't recommend putting in golds unless you're in the situation I am that these are the players that we've got recently. Now, if I go to the next page, I don't seem to have that many commons left. So I'm going to have to start putting in some low rated rares, but it doesn't really matter because you're not looking to get any of the high rated cards to put into the player picks, just the low rated, and we're not looking to put them in anything else. So we got another player pick there with our Vasquez, and we can also use that team of the week that I just mentioned as well into an 83 times 10, which I think in the long run is a better shout. So that 87 team of the week we got from the player pick is going to go into that. And we got an 86 Parejo as well, which is going to go straight into that exchange. And if you remember, we got two Parejos to put in because we got one from the exchange again as well from the pack we opened, if you want to rewind the video back and have a look. So that's going to give us 22 players, which again is a another three player picks and we're just getting them over and over again from just doing the exchanges that is how easy it is ladies and gentlemen you don't have to try as hard as you think you do once you get to this stage everybody that was watching they didn't know or obviously had a lot of things in their club and you're now trying to figure out what to do when you're in that situation this is literally it what you're seeing right now exchanges into picks back into exchanges back into picks until you get enough team of the weeks and until you get enough 85s 83s 84s once you've got all of those go stick them in that icon spc and you've got yourself it done and then we get packs on top of that as well from the icon spc don't forget but i'm going to go ahead and put parejo in another exchange and i'll be right back so parejo has been put into our last one that's another two player or 22 players that's another three player picks back i'm not going to open them right now and show you that you've got the idea of the concept any 85s to 86s, if you oh, sorry, 85 to 89s, if you don't have things in your club. If you do, then just keep putting 86s and higher in into those SBCs until you get yourself on them. So we've got 20, uh, 11, 22, 33, and then we've got 33 more players to get, which if you don't know is about 10 more picks. These packs I've got here from Objective, so I'm not going to count them. I've got all these bronze packs as well to get. So now, what do we do next? We're going to go back to our 83 times 10. Because it's 83 times 10. We've got a team of the week from the player pick, which has been absolutely useful. And you want to keep doing that until either you can do the team of the week player pick that we did or get a team of the week from the 80 plus player pick or whatever we got. And now we're going to go to newest and we're going to try to ship off a couple of these 83s. Not too many because we are going to get a, quite a lot of them. And we are going to put in a load of 82s into this because that is team of the week's 87 rated and team of the week's now in general are very, very high rated. We can actually go ahead and put quite a lot of low rated cards in. As you can see what we're doing here. So I'm going to go put this SBC anyway back once it's done. So it has been done. We've got three 83s in this, 81s and 82s. Now with that team in a week from the player pick, we now got our 83 times 10, which is going to be absolutely fantastic. Once you run out of these 83 times 10, doesn't mean you can stop. Just keep going with the pick into the exchange, into pick into exchange, until you build up enough club fodder in your club to do any of those SBCs that you want. So let's go ahead and open up this 83 times 10. If we get a team of the week in it, it speeds up the process. If you don't, it doesn't matter. It looks like that's going to be Tony Cruz. So another 86 to go into the exchange. Just that as well. Only Cruz, nothing else. You think, well, that's not a good pack. But again, we can break this down. So we've got one, two 85s to go into the 85. A load of 84s and a load of 83s. And we've got ourselves a Hoiberg, which is a duplicate. So right there, we have probably got enough fodder to be able to do the 84 squad in this Encore icon which needs a team in a week. So straight away, I'm just going to go and put this to newest, which means it's going to be all the cards that are packed in this video. And we're going to pop in every 84 we have. Hoiberg's going to go in there as well. These cards are going in, and we are going to find that team in a week that we got from our team in a week player pick in a second. Once I go back and forth and reset, there it is, 85. And then you can see here, we've built up all this fodder from just doing those SBCs. I've not got these from my club already. This has just been built over the time. Now, we have got a couple cards that are higher rated, so you can see there we can put in 383s. So the first segment from the Icon SBC has been done. 
got an 85 to go, an 83 to go. We need to get some more team of the weeks, but we have got ourselves a pack back from doing that. But that means now the next step is just to go back to our exchange packs that we've got that we haven't opened yet, send any duplicates back into our club like we do, and then we can start that process round again. So what we're going to do now is move over to our 11 players, have a look what we get out of this, and if I get anything good out of these packs, I'll obviously show you in the video. If I don't, is, is that's goalkeeper and Courtois. I'm going to laugh quite a lot, but it's probably not going to be. It's not. So we got an 83 again, an 84 duplicate, which is a little bit annoying. But there is an SBC that can go into if you find yourself in that system. So again, we got ourselves at least one player pick here and an 84 to deal with. So those duplicates have been put into this 80 plus pack. We've still got our 84 to deal with, but you can see they've all been put in just so you saw where they went. Back into our club to go. We're opening up our pick to see if we get anything good out of this. Get ourselves another 84 duplicates. So now we've got two 84 duplicates, but we know the 84 rated squad for the Icon SBC is done. So what can we do next? Now, there is this 85 campaign mix upgrade that you can do. There is also the daily showdown or any other of these cards that you want to do here. So what I like to do in this situation is go over to my upgrades, and I'm actually going to go ahead and do this 85 plus campaign upgrade. Reason being is you get a high rated card back, which can either just go straight away into the um, exchanges, or you've got yourself a situation where they can go into something else depending on how good they are, or even into your team if they're really good rated. Now, 83s are going to go into this because I'm really not that bothered about 83s at all. And we're going to go ahead and sort all these cards out. So we have got a Scrinier to find as well. The reason why Scrinier isn't coming up is because I didn't switch them over. So that means I have to go through my entire club. There he is at the bottom. So I'm just going to go ahead and do this, and I'll be back once it's done. So this has been done with all the cards that we've got from the most recent upgrade. I know you can say there's a few 85s in there that it shouldn't be. But at the end of the day, we've got one extra than we should have anyway. And now we've got ourselves to hit a really big card. If we manage to hit like an 89 out of this and it doesn't go into the team, that's going to give us 51 players back, which is like 12 to 15 player picks. Out of those 12 to 15 player picks, if you hit a team of the week or any other high rated cards, that's going to be even more fodder back. So that's the gamble you take. Oh, again, we're going to send our duplicate back into our club like we do and let's go open up this pack. So here we go then. Let's see what we get out of this. Now, I don't know what special card types there are. It's going to be Spanish Cam from Real Bet. So that's going to be an Isco. Now, you can go ahead and pop them into what you want. It's only 87. So the gamble hasn't been amazing in that sense of a payoff. So you've got two situations you can do here. If you don't have a lot of exchange packs saved like I did in the store, you can actually go ahead. What I mean by that is if I show you right now, if I scroll all the way to the end, if I don't have a lot of these packs spare, then you can go ahead and go and put them in the exchange. But with an 87, the gamble didn't really pay off. But with an 87, as you can see here, we only get 19 players back, which again is what, 6, 12, 18. So three player picks back. So I'm actually going to use that 87 in towards the Encore Icon SBC. If it was 88, I would definitely put them into that. But because it's 87, that's just going to help us in the long run to keep this nice and cheaper in terms of other cards that we can pop in. So our 84 screen here can go in. We can put this 84 Carrasco in. This cruise is going to go into an exchange because we haven't put him in yet. And we got ourselves on our way here. Now, we are looking for one more team in a week, as you know. So right away, we're going to go to the exchange, pop in our Tony Cruz to get 11 players back. And we still got 33 players from the exchanges to be able to open up and do player picks. So what I'm going to do again is pop Cruz into this SBC. And I'm going to go ahead and open up all of these exchange packs unless we get duplicates, which are then going to pick. So starting off with our first exchange pack, Let's see what we get out of this then. It's going to be a gold rare. It's going to be Uruguayan striker. It's going to be Nunez. So an 82 rated. So no crazy card out of that. But then there's only going into player picks anyway. And we've got ourselves three picks here to sort out with. So let me go ahead and make three picks and I'll be right back. So they have been recycled and we got the three player picks as promised from that. And we get ourselves an 83 that can go into the Icon SBC. Our next 83... Or, sorry, player pick there's going to be another 83. It's pretty predictable because you get 83s out of these all the time. And our next one here is going to be an 83. Now, I should take the 84, but for the purpose of the video, I'm going to take these 83s. Now, the reason being is I want to speed this up. It's already been 18 minutes, and I'm sort of trying to explain to you how to do this. So we're going to go ahead and open up our next exchange pack. We have got two left so far, so let's go ahead and open up our next one. Looks like a gold again. It's going to be Ghanaian centre-back, so I have no idea who that is. But again, these are going to help us with player picks. One duplicate, which is going to be Adam. So we're going to go ahead and make these player picks here. We've got ourselves two technically because one set over. So we can get two player picks out of these because of all the cards we got earlier. So we go and make those two 80 plus player picks quickly. So both those picks have been made. And now we've got ourselves two more. And we get ourselves an 85, which is fantastic for the Icon SBC. 
And one more pick to go out of this. We'll skip it. And another 83, which again is fantastic for the Icon SPC. So you can see here how we're building up that fodder. And we still have one more exchange pack to go. So let's go ahead and open up that one as well. So here is our last exchange pack for now. And let's see what we get out of this. It's going to be a gold again. It's going to be French. Left mid. Is our four's going to be coming. It's going to be 81. I forgot his name. But 81 Ray Terrier, I think it is. There we go. So again, we've got ourselves two more player picks to do. So let's go ahead and do these player picks. If you're wondering how I'm getting so many player picks, which I imagine is going to be a lot of your questions, let me take you through the process quickly. So what I'm doing now is putting any card that's 82 or lower into the player picks. Unless they are like a Premier League card or something like that. And I'll explain why in a second. But the reason why we're doing it this way is when I go to newest, it's just I can pop in every single one. One. And even if they're rare or common, doesn't make a difference. So right now on this page, you can see here we've got one and a half picks. Or one or just off a pick here. So we've got the first one done. We can then go ahead and submit that. As we go back on to the assign, assign list, you can see there we can send those three cards back in. And that's going to give us another player pick. So that's how I've been doing it. You might not have that many duplicates, depends on what the state of your club. But eventually, if you keep doing this, you will. So again, we're just going to do the exact same. Go back to the club here, go to newest, and then just swap them one by one as we go through. And then we've got ourselves another player pick. So you can see here, underneath our 83 rated or higher, I'm not putting them in. So what I'm doing now is going to look for things in my club that are basically 80, well, 75 to 81, essentially. So there's the two picks, and now we can move on to the next step. So let's go ahead and open up these picks and see what we get out of these two. So we get the first one, an 84, which is fantastic for the Icon SBC, or even a Team of the Week pick, because we do need one of those. And we get ourselves an 88, which has come in massively clutch. So with this 88, you already know what's going to happen with this 88. We are now going to go back, go to the SBC tab. We're going to make our way over to the exchanges. And that 88 rated card is going to give us 27 players, which is just short of five player picks, which is absolutely handy to have. So Orizabal is going to go into that. And now we've got ourselves five more player picks to try and get more exchange players. With also on top of this, this exchange pack we get, there is a chance of getting more walkouts out of that to then put into the exchange. There's also a chance of team of the weeks. And on top of that as well, any 85s that we need for the Icon SBC. So let's go open up this new uh, uh, exchange pack, whatever it's called. I forgot what it's called. So here we go. Then a 27 players pack. What do we get out of this? Is our pack lucky in at the moment? Doesn't look like it is for the video. It's going to be French. Right wing, PSG. Is that Dembele or Baltimore? It's going to be Baltimore. So only an 82, unfortunately. It would have been nice to get Dembele, but it is what it is. So again, we can just go ahead and make as many player picks as we want out of all of these. And we can swap these over one by one. So again, I'm going to go ahead and make five player picks. And I'll be back once that is done. So we have made four player picks. Let's open up the first one and see what we get. 82. So that's going to be another player pick later on down the line. Another 82. So you see here, picks aren't always the craziest broken. But like I say, the more you grind them, the more higher chances you've got of getting high rate fodder. And right there, we get an 86 to save us again. So again, you can see there, these can go into the Icon SPC or a Team of the Week pick. That 86 goes back into the exchange, and we have ourselves another player pick to build off that while grinding the other one. So you can see here, we're building up the club as we go through, and we're keeping the player pick grind going as we go around as well. So again, Cruz is going to go straight into this. It's another 11 players, and I'll be back once that is done. So we are going to go have a look if we can do another team of the week player pick because I have got an 83 times 10 left to do, as you saw. But we are going to go ahead and have a look what we need to do. So if we go to the team of the week player pick, we've got quite a lot of 82s in our club and a few 84s. So we are going to have a look. Bear in mind, we've already done the 84 rated encore one. So let's just go to newest and see what we have in here. So 82s can definitely go into this because we need 82s. There is a Bremer 84 rated at the bottom of the screen as well, which is going to help us. Now, do we have one more 84 that we can use? We do. We've got Carrasco there, so perfect. So, Screeny R Carrasco can go in, which we've also got. And then we can have a look what else we have here. So, we've got ourselves another 82 Nunez. Let's have a look at the bottom here. A79 or a 71 even, or whatever it is, 81. And is that going to be enough in terms of rating? Perfect. So, we have got that one done as well. We can go ahead and send that. We get a small prime players pack from that, which you can open. That's where I got those silvers from, if you're wondering where they came from. And that's going to help us on our way. But of course, we still got our exchange pack to open again as the grind continues to go around. So let's see what we get out of this. It's going to be a gold rare again. It's going to be ivory coast. It's going to be striker. It's going to be 83 Haller. I know that card off by heart. So an 83 to go into the team of the week pick. And we got ourselves two more player picks as well because of the last pack we had spare. And this one we've got here. So let me go ahead and make two more player picks. And I'll be right back. And they have been done as well. And recycled back into our class. We've got two more picks. 
Let's see what we get out of these. Anything decent? An 86 Trent. So you already know that's going to be 11 players back. And we get ourselves another one here. An 84, which is going to help us with an SBC. For example, the uh, Team of the Week one as well. So again, we got ourselves another player. So let me go sort that out. So Trent has gone into that SBC, another 11 players. And I want you guys to remember I'm not using objective packs or reward packs or anything like that. I'm just using these over and over again. It would be much quicker if I could use these objective packs that I've got from rivals, but I'm not going to use them for the sake of the video. I want to show you the process because if you do this with the extra packs on top, it's two times faster and you learn to recycle properly. So Trent's gone back into our club from going into the exchange. And let's open up another 11 players. It's going to give us another player pick. And it's a special card this time. It's going to be French, to mid is going to be from Nice, and I believe that's Taram, which is an 87. So, from that exchange, we got an 87 rated card. So, another one back, another player pick on top of that as well. And anything else is in this pack, so nothing else but player picks. But we have got an 87, which then again gives us more of the exchange packs. And an 87 is going to give us way more than an 86. I believe it's 19 players. So, let's go have a look now. So that's going to give us 19 players back. So again, that's going to be three player picks. So that one player pick's now turned back into three. We can recycle him back through and bang, in he goes. And now we are just laughing our way to the bank just by doing this only, remember. I know it's a long video, but like I say, I'm explaining to you the process. And now we can go ahead and do the player picks as well. So first of all, I'm just going to go to the store. I'm going to go ahead and send that to Ram back into my club because he's a duplicate. And then we can basically see what duplicates we have to do in terms of player picks. So we've got these three here. Perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and make those three player picks that we've got extra now. And I'll be right back. So I slightly miscalculated. There's actually two picks we get back, but it's not a problem. So let's go ahead and do our first one. And we get ourselves another 83, which I will take because we're going to do this into the team of the week pick. And then we have ourselves another player pick here which is another 83. So again, I'm going to go ahead and pop these into the team of the week player pick. We are going to go to newest. So you guys can see this is only from the cards I've packed in this video. It isn't from extra cards in my club or anything like that. We've just been from doing it from that. So as we need an 85, but if you remember, we had an Isco special card that we got from the campaign pack. That's going to go into our 85. So if we go to newest. These two can go in, not a problem. And as you can see there, if you've got a Hawkeyes, you can see there's a Martinez here, which is going to help us do this. And I believe we only need one. We do. So now we just need an 83 rated team. I'm pretty sure we have enough 83s here to do that. And as you can see on your screen there, we have got ourselves Isco. So once this is done, this is going to give us almost enough fodder to be able to do both of the SBCs that we are missing. And I haven't even opened these mixed player packs or anything that we've got from the team of the week. You can add them extra to player picks, silver upgrades, and etc. I'm just showing you the top tier packs and going around. So again, those two duplicates go into our club. Open up our team of the week pack and we get ourselves an 86 and two 83s. But don't forget, there is one more thing we need to do, which is this, our last 83 times 10. We haven't even done it yet, and we've almost got ourselves enough for the icon pack. So we are going to go ahead and pop in at this team of the week and the most recent cards we got. So in he goes. We're going to pop in these two 84s. And then these silvers, as you know, are actually from the mixed players pack that we got. Same as those bronzes, so we can work our way here. Koke can go in, and we can go ahead and pop in the rest of these cards. And we'll be back in a second once that's complete. So that has been complete, and we've done our last 83 times 10. Now, if our luck is really in, we'll get a team of the week out of this. If we don't, not the end of the world. We'll keep the process going. But I won't show you that anymore. You understand how that is. We'll just go ahead and open up the icon pack. So let's see what we get out of our 83 times 10 here. Here we go then, 83 times 10. It's going to be just a gold card. It's going to be French. It's going to be right wing. It's going to be Dembele this time. Surely it's going to be Dembele this time. And it is Dembele. So an 86 that can go into the exchange. Is there anything else in this pack that's going to help us? An 85, 84, and 83 Gabby. So not the best one there, but that is going to be enough to complete the rest. So let me be right back and do that right now. So we are doing the 85 rated team on the Icon SBC with our 83s and our 87 Isco we got. We've got that Dembele to put back round into a exchange pack, but we're just going to see if we can get away with putting in all these 83s first because we don't have any more 83 times 10s to do for today. So it doesn't look likely that's going to be an 84 rated. So we might be a little bit short here. So let me go have a look at something in my club quickly. So the 85 one has been done after I checked what was in our club that we had a little bit lower down. And that has now been completed. Bear in mind, like I said, we haven't opened up any more of our exchange packs or anything like that. Or our objective packs. We've got the 19 players to go in. 
And on top of that, we've got our Dembele 86 to go back around into another exchange. So you can see here, we're just building it up nice and slowly. So let's go ahead and open up this 19 players pack and wrap up this video now. What do we get out of this? Can we get a team of the week to slow up? Which we do get a team of the week right on cue there. So a team of the week from the exchange, which means now we can actually go ahead and complete the icon, as we say. An S85 rated. We got five duplicates here, which is going to give us more picks. So I'm going to go the same process. Go ahead and build the three picks we've got. And then we'll do this icon SBC and we'll be right back. So there we go. Three player picks have been made from that exchange pack. What do we get out of this? An 82 rated. We're going to take as many high rated cards as we can now because we have enough for that icon SBC. 83 is welcome. And our last pick from the exchange, another 83. Perfect. So let's head over to the icon SBC. As you can see, one left to go is an 83 rated team with a team of the week, which we got the team of the week from the uh, exchange, as you know. Going to newest, 183 goes in, an 83 goes in. We can put in 82s because we have a team of the week. Tiago can go in as well if we really need to boost up the rating. Dembele still needs to go into the exchange. We haven't done that, so we got ourselves ready to go around again using this method. And now we have two cards left. Now, I don't have many. Oh, there we go. It's perfect. I've got more 83s than I thought I had. So right there, we have completed it. We've done it from scratch all the way through this video. If you follow it step by step, you should be in the same position. If you are not, comment down below or join the Discord in the description. If you want to join the membership and learn to do this properly with no edits, 100% breakdowns and 100% responses to all of your questions, that will be in the comment section down below. And let's see who we get out of our Icon SBC after grinding it all together. We have no more packs to get. Come on, EA. Hook us up with something good with our hard effort. It's going to be French. Left mid. It's Pit. Wait, is that going to be Ribery, not Perez? It's Perez. <laughs> so that's what you get after all your hard work. If you have any questions, comment down below and I'll catch you in the next one.